today we are going to see the of the integrator first integrator first one is new circuit the output voltage output voltage which is equal to the integration of input voltage then the circuit is known as a integrator then the circuit is known as a integrator ede leda edena valemlo nirgamana voltage anedi nivesa voltage yokka samakalane ante aa valyanni integrator leda samakalane antaru idi chodadaniki inverting amplifier vale untundi integrator looks like a inverting amplifier but the feedback resistor is replaced with the feedback capacitor ikkada feedback resistor anedi feedback resistor r anedi deentha replace cheyabodindi feedback capacitor tho replace cheyabodutundi okay okay next next block diagram of integrator this is the block diagram this is the inverting terminal this is the non inverting terminal the signal signal is applying to the resistor r1 resistor r1 next non inverting terminal is connected to the analog terminal is connected to the ground okay this is the feedback capacitor cf feedback capacitor cf feedback capacitor cf okay next this is the v not v not v not v not v not okay this is a p in okay according to the virtual ground concept this is a g this is the v1 this is the v2 this is the v2 according to virtual ground concept v2 is equal to v1 the operational amplifier is the ideal operational amplifier let us other than amplifier right up to virtual ground concept which is v2 is equal to v1 v2 already connected to the ground v2 is equal to 0 v1 is equal to 0 means no current is passing through the inverting and non inverting terminal only the current is passing through the capacitor feedback capacitor the current is ic okay the input current i in i in passing through only feedback capacitor only feedback capacitor means according to kitchoff law the input current is only passing through the ic and in the ikkada input current anedi inverting non inverting terminal kunda pass avadu only feedback capacitor kunda maatrame pass avutundi equivalent circuit this is the equivalent circuit this is the r1 this is the v in this is the v1 this is the feedback capacitor feedback capacitor this is the v not this is the v not according to kitchoff law i in i this is current here the current is passing through the input rest r1 i, I in i in is equal to v in minus v1 by r1 okay na here v2 is equal to v1 v2 is equal to v2 is equal to 0 means v1 is equal to 0 means i in is equal to v in by r1 only v in by v in by r1 only means i in is equal to v in by r1 means v1 is equal to 0 okay next the current passing ic ic is equal to dq by dt q is equal to cv means here the voltage the voltage voltage across the capacitor vc vc is equal to here v in minus v not v in minus v in v in minus v not okay means 
C V minus V naught. V C is equal to V uh, sorry V one minus V naught. Here V one is equal to zero according to the virtual ground set. V C is equal to minus V naught. I I C is equal to D Q by D T. Q is equal to C V. I C is equal to minus C C D V V C. This is V C. V naught by D T D T. Okay. Next. I I C is equal to minus C D V naught by D T. Okay. I I in is equal to I C. I in what? I in is I in what? V one by R one is equal to minus C D V naught by D T. D V naught by D T. Okay. V V so V in by R one is equal to minus C D V naught by D T. Integrating both sides. Integrating both sides. V naught is equal to minus R one by C is equal to V in into D T. According to our definition, the output voltage, which is integration of input voltage, that is the, that is the integration.